Hey, hey, what's up, YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. It's your boy, Achi Bonkers. And this video should be quick. Um, just an update on the Suburban. Um, for real, for real. I'm going to tell y'all what happened. Um, I got impatient. And I don't want the Suburban, so we pulled the motor out. It's a 5.3. Uh, I think the my actual numbers for it will be a... L59 or something like that. I gotta double check it, but. I got a race car motor now, y'all. I don't know exactly what I'm gonna do with it. I gotta do some more research on building it, but I have found a Camaro for 500 bucks, right? So um, I'm gonna just break this down real quick, show y'all something. I bought a truck for $400. Um, it ran and drive, whatever. Truck's still sitting right there, but I'm about to send it to the scrap yard. A bunch of people have took parts off of it already. Um, I sold the TV radio that was in the truck. Um, I got a bunch of shit for myself. I got an ECU, mass airflow sensor. Um, I had that wiring harness, but I'm gonna get a standalone. But more of the story, I might could break even and get my 400 back just out in parts and shit like that in the truck. So at the worst, I'm, I'm gonna be wasting like $100 or some shit like that to to have a 5.3, but hey, it's all right. It's all right. I know what I want. I know what I want to do, so that's what I'm going to do. We got a 5.3. Uh, I'm going to clean it up real good. We're going to paint it. Y'all get in the comment section. Let me know what color should we paint it. I did my last one black and red. I don't know what I'm going to do, but I want to paint my block and I'm going to paint the valve covers. I'm going to leave the uh, heads just the aluminum color because I don't feel like messing with it, but yeah, y'all get in the comment section. Let me know what color I should paint it. Um, and I want to know what kind of intakes is y'all running on y'all's because I need a small intake because I'm really, I'm like this close to buying a Fox, I mean, a F, uh, F body Camaro, like a catfish body style. I'm very close to buying that. So, yeah, I just wanted to show y'all that is my new 5.3. I guess I cut this, uh, I guess I can flip the camera around and show y'all what the actual truck looking like right now. It's probably devil. It, it probably got to be something. It's probably some good content because, whew. All right, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to flip the camera around and show y'all. All right, so it's kind of dark out here now, but uh, should, you should be able to see once it's like up close. Uh, that's... This was going on. That's the transmission. Ain't no motor. We took all this shit out. All that shit out. Just cut everything that was in our way. I might take this steering box for my Yukon because my steering not the is not the tightest right now. But that is a good transmission um, or a decent transmission. If you was gonna have it rebuilt or something, you could get that. Rest of the truck. Um, Look like a bomb went off in here. We stole all the door panels. The sunroof was taken for taken for somebody else's junk. Um, I do got a guy coming to get the grill, the bumper, hood, mirrors off of it um, before I send it to the scrapyard. Um, but yeah, it looks like a fucking bomb went off in here. Bomb dog, you got headlights. There's still some parts in there. The rear door panels are still there, even on the other side. Um, somebody came and took the hatch. I just asked them to put this hatch back on here. Like, that's just rig it up for the weight purpose. Because uh, I could still make a couple dollars off of it. This one was messed up. We had to cut a big hole in there to even get it off his truck. But yeah, that's, um, that's what's going on. This video ain't gonna be long. I ain't got much for y'all. I just figured I'd show y'all. And I guess I'll break this down to y'all too. My uh, Yukon, y'all you know, can't see nothing. But my Yukon, we are at the Yukon. Um, my Yukon, for some reason, it ain't making that lifter noise no more. So I don't really know, but I did add some Lucas to it. So it's probably just the Lucas. So I'm probably just gonna continue to run some Lucas in there for a minute. I ain't really pressed to put a motor or do the cam shit, but one day, one day, uh, it'll happen. Um, 
But yeah, the Yukon, that's the best it's gonna get. Nothing to talk about about the bands. That truck gotta go. I'm sorry, y'all can't see shit. But um, yeah. I ain't finna hold y'all, cause I'm finna go get some Chinese. So let me flip this camera around real quick. Actually, I uh, decided not to flip the camera around. I'm just gonna show y'all what I did. Cause I think the other time I was showing y'all was might have been kind of hard to see, but I took the like, it's all dirty, so took the uh, core packs off. You don't really want to get them wet anyway. Um, I, the intake was off when I took the motor out, but it's back on. Them intakes off. I took all the wiring harness off. I gotta hit these bolts and take this motor mounts off. But um, get in the comments if y'all want to see a build series on this. Look how nasty that is. Um, I've never built a motor, so I don't really know what I'm doing, but I've seen a few guys put them together, so we're going to try, because this is a cruiser. I just want this to cruise forever. Um, so I'm going to build me a little street car motor with this, and we'll find out what uh, what she could do. Um, and I just ain't had a chance to take this, so that's why I still sitting like this. But, um, yeah, that's the 5.3. Um, yo, my neighbor, Reek. Um, I do plan on, I got all these speakers out the truck. I'm going to build me a little, like a little small stunt wall for the garage mount up there so we can play some music. And I got these marine speakers right here. Somehow I want to find like a plastic box or something to mount them to make them. You know, I'm gonna mount them up outside. Sorry, Rick. Shit. Um, yeah. So that's the motor. We just trying to clean it up. I'm, it's gonna be a whole another video about that, so y'all get to see the whole process. Um, but yeah, as of right now, that's it. I'm about to flip the video around and. Ah, uh, yeah. So like I said, this, this is the end of the video and wrap it up here. Um, subscribe to my channel. Um, we still doing a giveaway for two hundred and fifty dollars when I get to a thousand subscribers. Um, if this one goes successful, there will be plenty more giveaways in the future. But hit that subscribe button, enter yourself to win, um, and get in the comment section. Let me know if y'all want to see a build series of this because I show y'all I'm gonna do it. I feel bad because I did a poor job showing it on that one. I got another opportunity to show y'all so. That's what we're going to do. But it's your boy, Archibongas, and I'm out of here.